Okay, so here we are in the Visual Code Studio. We're going to go ahead and do a uh, new file. Actually, we're going to go down here to the LEGO EV3 extension and we're going to create a new project. Um, and I'm just going to call this uh, Motor Demo because we're going to use the one from the guide. So I'm going to call it Motor Demo. It's going to ask where you want it to save. So you have to pick a folder where you want to save your files. Uh, I have previously created one, so I have one here uh, on my desktop, EV3 Python. So I'm going to go ahead and choose that as my folder. And now we're going to get a program. Now I'm not going to teach you all the coding to Python. There's plenty of guides and tutorials. We just want to make sure that you know how it works. So you notice that I've got my brick plugged in right here to the USB and then it's plugged into my, my computer so I can download the program. And so here's my folder. Here's the main part of the code. And what we're going to do just for simplicity is I'm going to go here. Um, they have a demo here of just plugging in the motor into port B. And I've just copied this code and it tells you to make the main Pi program look just like that. So that's what we're going to do. I'm just going to um, go ahead here. I'm going to swap all that out. I'm going to paste that code in. There we go. Um, and then you can see once we have that, we want to be able to get it downloaded to our device. So we can download this to our, our, our brick. And the way that we're going to do that is we're going to go down and pick our device. I don't have it picked my device yet. So we're going to go here to click here to connect a device. Here's my device right there. There we go. Just trying to connect. You can see that spinning down there. We are connected. But what we want to be able to do is get this going. So um, we can upload the file, we can download it as you can see here in this code. The motor demo. There you go. So there we go. We ran the program there. I can go ahead and run this again. So just a very simple program, but you can see that's how it works. Just going in there, here's the download button, um, and away we go. It sends it, and we can rock, and we can roll. So now the challenge comes into, if you don't know Python, to learn Python, and if you know Python, get rocking and rolling with the EV3 brick. All right, guys, hope you found this helpful. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to let me know. This is just the beginning of understanding how we can get code from our program to the brick, in this case, using Python. All right, my friends, stay awesome.